In this step-by-step -step tutorial, I'll show you how to add AI voiceovers to your Canva designs, videos, or presentations. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, Canva is really awesome at creating presentations. But let's assume you don't want to use your voice or probably you've lost your voice and you just want to make a video presentation with voiceover or even a video. Now, Canva is loaded with a ton of apps and these apps can be a game changer to you. And one of those apps is Muff AI. Now, what is Muff? Just go to the website for Muff and it's a text to speech software, more or less a really awesome AI voice generator. Now, it kind of mimics human voices and gives you kind of AI generated voices. It's really versatile. So you'll need two accounts, a Canva account, and I'm using a Canva free account and a math.ai free account to show you what you can do this. Now, so I already have my account here. I'm logged in. I can actually click on studio so that you can see it's the math.ai free account. So it's a free plan. Uh, and then that's okay. Canva as well, it's a free plan. To add Math AI as an application, you can either click on this apps icon here. If I click on this, I can actually now search for the app. Let's go for Math. You'll see Math AI. And it is this particular one, an easy way to add voiceovers to your design. But let's actually just go back home and just click on presentations. And let's say we want uh, whatever presentation, let's say, uh, let's say we go with this particular presentation here. And you can already see it's more or less just a one page right now, but you can actually click on apply all pages. So it's going to apply all pages to this and you can actually tweak it the way you want. Now, uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to add math. So if you do not add math from the home page uh, right there, you can still add it when you're inside a design. So I'm going to click on apps right here on the left, click on that, and then come to search and type in math AI, and just click on this. And you can see other apps right inside here. But what, uh, what is of importance is Math AI. Click on that. And you can see uh, it's created by Math. Add voiceovers to your Canva design. Uh, you can just actually just see uh, what else is available here. Just scroll through and see what uh, comes up. So you can add natural sounding voices to your design. Bring your Canva designs to life with Math's realistic AI voices. Pick from a range of high quality voices across different languages, emotions, tonalities. All you need is a script. So if you have a script, then this is good for you. And you can click on open. By using this app, you agree to the terms and conditions. So that's okay. I'll click on open. It's actually going to log me in to my account before it's uh, it's actually going to notice here. So Mafia wants to connect to your account. Click on connect. It's actually going to pop it up. It sees my studio. Uh, let's connect to this account. It's going to connect to my account and you can see the workspace. It's a free uh, account and uh, the way you logged in, click on that. And now there are a couple of options here. So you can select the language English, US and Canada. And then from the drop down, you can see a ton of more languages all the way French, German, Spanish, Italian, Portuguese, Chinese, Russian, Dutch, Japanese, Hindi, Indonesian. Let's say we go with English, US and Canada. And you can now select a voice. You can click on see all to see all the voices available. But one thing you'll notice, there's a padlock right here. Upgrade to math.ai pro to use this voice. So there's some free voices for you to test out. And then we have some paid voices. And you can actually see most of the voices are paid, but we still have some good uh, free voices for you to use. So let's say we go with Miles and you can click on this play button to kind of hear how Miles sounds like. If I click on it. At some point in life, we have all wanted to take photos. Sounds really good. So we go with uh, Miles and then from there, you can enter your text right here. So let's say uh, we actually just 
uh, enter research proposal presentation and then press on uh, just add a full stop right there so once you do that that is your text is kind of your script what style do you choose either conversational promo narration calm newscast sad if we keep scrolling down angry terrified inspirational and those styles can really work out well for you now we're going to go with conversational and you can adjust the speed and the pitch so i'll just leave everything as it is for us to have a listen and then i'll click on generate voiceover once i do that it's going to actually rotate uh and give you the voice research over. proposal presentation now let's play again research proposal presentation that sounds really really good we can now click on add to design and once i do that it's going to be added to this particular slide so uh it's been updated and you can also see how many minutes of generation you have left and for advanced switches you can visit this particular studio so let's assume uh that's the first one then we come to this other one uh let's say we actually just choose this what we're going to do now is let's click on this just add the text again and then click on generate voiceover background of the study let's click on add to design and it's going to be added so you can keep doing that all the way to the end but when we look at this this is what it looks like if you can actually click on present and let's say click on auto play let's click on present background of the study uh, let's go to the start research proposal presentation background of the study now looks good just for test purposes now it's super super awesome that you can easily add ai voiceovers to your presentations videos or event designs try it out and see if it works best for you thanks for watching and i hope this video is of value to you